they were so COVID careful. And then... Two weeks ago, I had family over at my house for, my, for some cake for my wife's birthday. I didn't think anything bad would happen. I went to my nephew's house and loved seeing my family. But now, I'm fighting against COVID-19. Fighting still. More than a dozen of them later tested positive. One family. Alexa Aragona is now part of that family and is with us. Alexa, you weren't at the party, but you dropped your mom off there. What do you want other people to know through this PSA and this appearance? Please do not gather in small and close places with those that do not live in your household. We were so careful. It only takes one person to feel ill and under the weather to have an outbreak in your family. You, you say you were careful. So masks and distancing and washing and all the things we all try to do. Correct. I mean, my mother even made masks and shipped them to multiple parts of this country. And even then, she still felt she still was the worst in my family with COVID-19. And then you just got tired of it all. We all do. I don't know. Yeah, it, it, we got necess not necessarily tired, but just our guard fell. Yeah. Uh, we just got comfortable and fell back into normal habits. And so you went to the party and everything felt great. And then... And then 12 were that were there tested COVID positive and then affected three more of my family. I know your mom was bad. How is she? She's doing better. Um, last night wasn't great. Uh, she had uh, some heart issues because she was very scared from the tornadoes that happened here in Arlington, Texas. Mm. Um, so she's going to fight this long term. It, you know, this happens, sadly, to many thousands and tens of thousands of people. Not everybody does all this. Wh wh where'd you get this and why are you doing this? And tell me. I work for the city of Arlington, and this is like a natural uh, extension of what I do for my job in communication and legislative affairs. My family knows that it's a great project of mine to make sure that our residents in Arlington have a communication both in Spanish and in English about COVID-19. When this unfortunate circumstance happened to my family, we came together and discussed one by one what we think and if it was possible, and they decided that our story of pain and suffering was going to was uh, gladly put in the, in the forefront of the public so we can all learn a little lesson from it. Alexa Aragonez and all the Aragonez, good luck to you guys. Thank you. Lots of love. Thank you. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.